Alright, today we're going to see how we swap out some seats on the boat. Or these Tempris tieback Elite chairs to replace the stock ones on the boat. Should be pretty straightforward. Just remove the pedestal from the boat. There's a four bolt pattern that's pretty much standard in the industry. It should just bolt right back on, put the mount back onto the pedestal, and we should be done. All right, first thing I'm going to do is just remove the seat from the pedestal. Not really sure what we have here, but well, that appears to be pretty stiff. There's a release pin on the side right here. I'm going to attempt to just pull that and see if the seat lifts up. All right, here's what it looks like. I did just, in fact, pull that release clip on the side here. And lifted the seat and it came right off. So we're going to two. You can see the pin. It just pulls and then lifts. Take the seats off the boat where I can uh, deal with them a little bit in a more friendly environment on the ground. All right, so here's the three seats set up on the table. There's a sliding mechanism here. There's four bolts. The seats are kind of universally uh, designed for either the, the larger attachment or uh, the smaller one. What I want is for these pedestals to slide, which they're currently kind of seized. So while I'm still having them attached on the old uh, seats, I'm going to get some grease grease these tracks a little bit and use a rubber mallet or plastic hammer to kind of free them up and get them moving before I proceed to actually installing them on the boat. Alright, I greased them up. I use a rubber hammer, hammer uh, mallet. Uh, unlock the brake and bang it back and forth a couple of times. Use a little WD-42 to get them loose. Not all that impressed with how far I got them undone or loose. So we'll see how they act on the boat. Now I'm just going to remove the old mounting screws. And I see already we're going to have a problem. These are self tapping and these are machines, so we're already going to have a mounting issue that is going to require us going to the hardware store. Sucks for me. I seem to recall the same thing when I was changing the seats on my other boat. The mounting thing, and apparently it left us some um, manufacturing creep in the chair. Alright, quick run to the hardware store. Has procured procured some stainless steel screws. Hopefully, match this thread. I didn't just leave a chance, but you never know. Now, on the drive, I was thinking all the years of boating, I've never actually adjusted a sliding seat forwards and back. Leads me to wonder whether I should worry about that track sliding or if it wouldn't be in the best interest to put the other four bolts in in the center so that I have eight bolts holding the seat down. It actually would be a lot safer with regards to um, 
let's say a boating accident occurred or something and somebody was sitting in the seat, having the seat more secure. So I haven't really decided yet. But now I've decided since I just looked and see that the screw holes do not match up. I want them flush. I don't want to go too tight since I'm a little concerned as to those nuts stripping out of that plastic. They seem to be pretty well anchored in there. Alright, one seat finished. off some of that excess oil that I put on there. Great. Alright. I believe I'm going to go wash my hands and then I'm going to go try to put that one on the boat just to get a rough idea of uh, whether the uh, center post mount is in the right place. Alright, so I'm on my way up. I'm going to wash my hands again. I just don't want to get grease on a new seat. Although there's a little bit of discoloration here, but that came from the factory like that. Alright, so now I'm heading up. Man, this stuff feels heavier. And 
two seats. How do you like me now? Interesting that this one sits forward more. Oh yeah. Why well, it's gonna be comfy here. Oh yeah, this one feels better. <laughs> because it's on the captain's side. So, that's how you swap your seats out. Other than making a run to the hardware store. For some extra hardware. Um, that's all there is to it. A couple of screws on each seat to swap out. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Maybe uh, you found it useful because you're thinking about switching to some seats. These, by the way, are Tempris high back elite seats. Um, I purchased them at West Marine. They do a real good job over there um, with customer service, so you might consider getting yourself a pair from there. It's definitely, I uh, haven't tried it yet on the water, but I gotta say they feel really comfy. I'm very pleased with it uh, for the uh, price. Um, a great upgrade for your boat. Don't forget to like the video, leave a comment if you have any questions below. Thank you.